The effect of temperature on equilibrium position of a reversible reaction. Note this. The effect of temperature on the position of equilibrium depends on only one thing, which is the value of the entropy change. And what is entropy change? Entropy change simply means the heat content or heat change of the reaction. Now, when a chemical reaction takes place, it is either the reaction produces heat or the reaction absorbs heat. If a reaction is carried out and heat is produced during the process, we say that the reaction is exothermic which simply means entropy change is negative. But when a reaction is carried out and the heat is absorbed by the reaction, we simply say that the reaction is endothermic. Now let's quickly take a look at this question and see how to solve it. Question says, from the equation given, which is this one on the board, a decrease in the temperature of the reaction will dash. A decrease in the temperature of the reaction will dash. We have been asked to tell what will happen when the temperature of this reaction in equilibrium state is decreased. Remember, the effect of temperature depends on the value of entropy change. So whenever a question is given to you on temperature effect, the first thing you should do is to find out the value of entropy change. You don't actually need the number. What you need is the sign, whether the entropy change is a positive value or a negative value. Now, from the equation given to us, as you can see, the entropy change is positive. Remember, when entropy change is positive, it means the reaction is endothermic. And when a reaction is endothermic, as I said, Assume within you that the product is in a cold state. That's just a rough assumption. But when entropy change is negative, it means that the product is in a hot state. For now, we are giving a positive entropy from the question, which simply means the product is in a cold state. Now ask yourself, this person that is cold, what can you do to favor him? or not to favor him. Ask yourself this question. If you are feeling cold, if we increase your temperature, are we going to favor you? Yes, of course. When you feel cold, you find a way, sweater or what have you, or heater to warm up your room. What are you trying to do when you do all those things? You're trying to increase the temperature of your system. That means for you to be cold, an increase in temperature will favor you. But if you are cold, and we reduce the temperature of your room the more by turning on the air conditioner, we we'll make the room colder. We are not favoring you. So let's answer the question. For this reaction, which the entropy change is positive, which I told you means that the product is cold, they are asking us, a decrease in temperature of this reaction will do what? Now check. If the temperature of this reaction is decreased, what will happen? Focus on the product. What is the state of the product? The state of the product depends on the value of entropy change. Now that entropy change is positive, tell yourself that the product is cold. Now, decreasing this temperature, this is cold already, the product side. It is cold. Decreasing the temperature will not favor them because they're already cold. What they need is increase in temperature. So since the temperature is decreased, it simply means the product side will not be favored, right? And whatsoever that does not favor the product side will favor the reactant side. So our answer simply means that equilibrium will shift to the left. To the left. Favoring the backward reaction. I hope you understand this explanation. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to like our page.
share our links and our videos to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.